Hi everyone, so today I have a haul for you and today it's going to be a cat haul. Um, so most of this stuff was for this little man here. Um, you don't know who he is unless you're on Twitter, Instagram or Facebook. So watch out for the next video all about him. Um, so most of this stuff was bought for him and Tiggs and I hope you enjoy the haul. So the first thing we got was this James Well Beloved adult turkey dry biscuits and um, I'm well aware that this isn't the best food you can get but the cats do like it and it's what we can purchase at the moment because that's what we have available. It costs £12 for a 1.5 kilogram bag. It won't last too long but anyway that's what we feed the cats primarily. Can't say that word. The next thing I got is more food and this is something I've never tried before. It's the applause um, but it's the multiple fish selection and the chicken selection. I think they are pouches or tins. I've never um, used these or seen these before. They've just come into my local pet store and they're reduced to only £4 and it comes with eight of them. I'm just going to open it so we can see what it actually is. I see, I see. So in a box it comes with eight and you get these little, um, little sort of pots which is pretty cool. And this is tuna with crab. And these are all utterly healthy and natural. And yep, they are like that. And yeah, I think these will be great for the cats. I th hopefully they'll love them. They only cost £4. And I got the fish one and the chicken selection. So hopefully they will like those. I the next thing we got wears this collar and this is for Ralphie and it's just so that um, while he goes outside which he's starting to do but we're doing it on a harness and lead first because he's never been outside before but once he's off the harness and leash we can get him into a collar and out he can go by himself. We do live in the middle of nowhere and it's got lots of fields um, but there are a few neighbours so we just like to stick on the collar and identity tag to make sure that he, if he gets lost he will be returned and I got the bright yellow because he is black and yellow and black go well I guess so because Ralphie doesn't wash himself because he doesn't know how he has never been taught as he was abandoned from a very young age he stinks and he is super dirty so I thought I'd get him a good quality brush um, so that I can brush him and this is the by Good Boy and it's an easy clean slicker and I didn't understand this, but what you have to do is press the button down and then the bristles come out and they're like really thin bristles and then once you're done you press the button again and in the bristles go and the hair will come out so it doesn't get stuck inside which is really really helpful because usually it's such a pain to get the hair out of a brush especially if it's quite spiky like this so you just press the button down and you, the hair come is just left anyway so this is a super handy brush and I can't wait to use it on him and the last thing we got was this pet shampoo and um, we are going to bath the cat and a lot of people are probably going to be really against this but you're not meant to bath cats at all so don't do it just for fun um, but you can do it under necessarily um, really like you have to and we do have to because he had cat flu and then he had um, another illness and so his um, business hasn't been very solid and it has gone all down him he stinks and it's his fur is just disgusting and he just needs one really really good shower and then from then on we can brush him every day to keep him clean but because he's in such a state we do need to give him a well I say shower it's more going to be of a bath but I got this sh this shampoo and it's from this brand and it looks like a good natural one. It's aloe and oatmeal. Usually it says aloe vera but it just says aloe. Um, but it's cucumber and melon and it smells divine. I really do like it. And hopefully he'll let us use it on him and give him a nice bath to get rid of his stink. But it does say su safe to use on cats because a lot of dog shampoos aren't but this is actually for um, any pet I think um, well cats and dogs primarily keep saying that word I don't know why um, but yeah that's the shampoo we're going to use on him and like I said we'll probably only use it once and then keep him in good condition till then um, 
But yeah, that cost me like £7, which is quite expensive. And I didn't mention, but the brush was £5, which was really cheap. And this is all from the Pet Hut. So thanks for watching, guys. I'm trying to do my videos less rambly because I seem to talk for England. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this haul. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you'd like to see more. We'll see you next time.